from the coma. You can understand that, right? You know what I understand? I understand that you are under arrest. You know, Jan Spears, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can... Wait! Use... I remember something else from that day. I remember your father trying to strangle me. Now, I'm not a cop or a lawyer, but I'm pretty sure that's attempted murder. So if I'm going down, so is Daddy Dearest. What have you been holding back? I remember something else about that night. Gunshot. What'd you say? Well, How'd it go? What happened? Good news and bad news. Well, just give me the good news first. The good news is she dropped the murder charges and you're free to go. <laughs> okay, okay. There... Oh, God, there's bad news. What is it? What's the bad news? Yeah, well, the bad news is is that she's uh, thinking about bringing other charges against you, you know, lying to the police, tampering with the evidence. Oh, blah, blah, blah. Who cares? It's not a murder charge, is it? Why didn't you tell the police then? Why didn't you tell Rafe that night? And why pretend you didn't know he was dead? I have no reasons. When I first got to Charlie's apartment, I saw someone leaving. Who was it? Trip. It was trip. So Rafe's not gonna give up until he knows who really shot Charlie. Yeah. I mean he won't give up not only until he knows who shot Charlie, but until he knows also how he can prove it in a court of law. There is nothing more important to Rafe than justice. Allie, there's something I need to tell you. 